Good, in, good afternoon, everybody. For those who don't know me, my name is Fernando. And I'm definitely just following the footsteps of my big sister, Celia. <laughs> and my little sister, Mel. And uh, I, just, I just wanted to come and just share my joy because I wasn't able to share at church because I had to, uh, an errand to run. So um, I just wanted to say that um, I would like to also represent the young adults of Father and Father. And uh, I don't need to tell you that I'm not worthy enough because everyone in here, like my brothers and sisters know exactly what, who, what kind of person I am and the outsides and stuff. But I felt that I needed to come up here to just share that it's okay. It's all right, like, I'm here. At times, you know, praise and worship, we've had a lot, this is not our first ones, but uh, we feel a little pressured at times to come up here, you know, like that eye. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know, we, 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 then we become defensive. I, I become defensive. Because, you know, I don't know what to say. Um, but I realize why we do this, is because I, I become vulnerable to be able to share my faults and flaws with everyone in here. Because I trust you all to understand the things that I go through, and, and, and yet I'm here. Our friend for God always tells us we're going to be fools, at least be fools for God. And um, I'm here being a fool, <laughs> trying to figure out uh, what my life is, 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 is going to become in the future. I would like to thank both of the singers. I do remember you when we were kids. And we used to sing um, our, our song for Sunday school and both of the testimonies. I think that um, us as young adults, as we move on and we move forward, we still become a little confused on, on what our place is here in church. Um, I'm not here to preach because of, oh, I shouldn't. That's my mom, not me. Um, but I'm here to tell you that that so whoever out there that feels like you're not worthy enough or you shouldn't come up here because you feel like you don't have the love on me inside your heart, just know that you're not the only one. I'm, I'm the same. Here I am, a grown woman, my master's degree, and I'm still lost. I hope that with me sharing this, that you become vulnerable with those close to you. And that you trust that the God, that our God, my God, will wrap His heart around you as He does me. There is so much joy in my heart, and it's and it started a long time, even when our church was going through a lot of difficulties. Not in my heels. I don't know if I'm supposed to say that, but <laughs> sorry. <laughs> But throughout everything, I've learned so much from each pastor. That when when things get tough and, and the world's chaos and the change is so different, you have to look at the main goal of why we're here, you know? Like, the main goal is for us to, to thank the Lord. I can't tell you what I did yesterday, but because the Lord loves me, I was able to get back here today. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you my mom said right there. <laughs> I can't keep second guessing the Lord. I, I gotta keep coming back. I have to make sure that I'm here for church. I'm here for Akohima, Akohisi. Anything that, that I can do to be able to just try to try to stay and try to thank the Lord. Like He's blessed me and my girls, my sisters, my family, my friends, my new friends. I've, I see a lot of old faces here from before. I see a lot of the same faces. And yet, I see a lot of um, faces of uh, discomfort and a lot of faces of uh, confusion. And I just wanted to say that I have the same face too. And I hope that you guys keep coming back so together we can figure this thing out. Because you know, like, it's, it's a journey. I, it's a journey, it's a struggle. Um, my mom is a But <laughs> I just wanted to say thank you all for uh, coming today. And I hope that you guys keep coming. I'm gonna keep coming. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep coming. I'm gonna come together. You know, do this thing to the Lord. And uh, 
to Jesus, to God, thank you so much for giving me another chance to be able to um, to be able to realize what I'm supposed to be doing. To be able, yeah. And I just wanted to just finish it off with just saying, I want to sing soon. Yeah. I'm not going to sing it because. <laughs> But if the band can just hang out. Yeah. Thanks, guys. <laughs>